I think just um, you know the first impressions kind of over and just being familiar with uh, the process, how things work. Uh, you know, familiar faces in the coaching staff and you know in the locker room makes a big difference. I think uh, the transition makes you know everything kind of key. I think coming into a season, you're trying to get to know everybody and get to know new systems and what's expected. And you know, coming into a second year, you're you're just kind of uh, you know stepping right back into it like you never left. And it's uh, you know it's great to be comfortable and uh, you know I'm excited to get going. Do you even have to work harder as you know you progress as a pro in the off season to get yourself ready for for a season than maybe when you were a fresh rookie coming out of uh, coming out of college and coming out of the uh, the minor ranks? Uh, I think you know I think it's just uh, it's all a mentality. I think uh, when I was a, you know a little bit younger coming out of college, I think just the level that I was trying to get to it was uh, you know it seemed like a lot harder work and um, just the standard that we have kind of got to now in the game. It's uh, it's pretty been pretty standard here the last five or six years in terms of you know, conditioning and, uh, you know, kind of, you know, expectations. So I don't think there's been any uh, adjustment in terms of effort, but uh, obviously the older you get, you got to take more care of yourself and uh, just make sure you're ready to go because uh, these young guys coming in are highly talented and, uh, you know, they're hungry to take a job. You mentioned the young guys coming in and now your role here in Bakersfield, maybe even more of a veteran role even this season than, than even last year. Do you kind of embrace that, that kind of veteran role uh, here in Bakersfield with, with some of the guys that you mentioned that are coming into the organization here this year? Yeah, you want to be, uh, you know, you want to be a good teammate and uh, you know, lend a helping hand whenever you can. I think uh, more so off the ice and on, I think on. Um, that's kind of a learning experience that as a, you know, as a team we're all going to go through together. But off the ice, just to be you know, a good teammate kind of, you know, gives the ins and outs and, you know, kind of how to do things and conduct yourself is important. And that's the way I was treated when I came in and uh, definitely made my transition from, you know, minor hockey and, you know, uh, college into pro, just a lot more easy transition. So um, it's key for the organization just to have a, you know, a tight-knit group down here. And then uh, I think it's, you know, it starts with, uh, you know, the older guys just being good communicators. You played for a lot of head coaches. You played in a lot of organizations. What have you noticed early on about Jay Woodcroft, both from your time in Edmonton and now here in Bakersfield? He's got a lot of passion. I think uh, you know that's the big thing. He's uh, he's happy to be here. He wants to be here. He he wants to help us uh, get better as individuals and you know as a team. I think the you know that's obvious right from day one here. And you know everything uh, you know everything's uncovered here. Every every little detail's touched upon. And um, you know when you focus on the little details, when uh, you know, the big moments come to rise, I think we're going to be prepared as a team. And um, I think we're going to see just, uh, you know, a group of guys that are very detail oriented. And that's, uh, you know, great for us here. And then I think it's a good transition to try and make it to the next level as well. A little off topic, but uh, new addition uh, this off offseason. Uh, what's it been like uh, being a first time dad here this offseason? Yeah, man, it's been amazing. I think uh, you don't really know what to expect. Everyone tries to, you know, give their own stories, whether it's uh, good or some horror ones. But uh you know, uh, Brielle and I have been, you know, very blessed and very lucky to, you know, have a healthy baby. And, you know, he's been really happy and we're, you know, enjoying the process. And just, uh, you know, every day those little things that, uh, you know, you see him, you know, pick up something new. It's, uh, you know, I can't really put words into it. It's, uh, it's amazing.